Hi, this is John Campus, founder and CEO of Empus. On today's Coffee with Campus, I want to talk to you about email extortion scams. The FBI reported that instances of email extortion rose 242% in 2018, and they're continuing to rise in 2019. Because of its increasing popularity among cyber criminals, it's crucial that you understand what email extortion is and how you can avoid it. Email extortion scams, sometimes called sextortion scams, occur when scammers send bulk emails to email addresses found in the dark web. These emails are usually sent to hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people at a time. They typically threaten to distribute private materials such as sensitive photos or videos of you to your contacts unless you pay the sender. Payments are made using an anonymous type of cryptocurrency like Bitcoin. To make it even more believable, the email may contain a password that you have used in the past. Anyone would be nervous if they received an email like this. I have personally received dozens of calls from concerned customers who are the recipients of this exact scam. The good news is the scammer likely does not have the compromising content they are threatening you with. They are just trying to scare you, so it's very important that you do not send them any money. The FBI reports that people have already paid scammers over $83 million in response to email extortion. This is all pretty scary, so what can you do about it? First, use a password manager to create different complex passwords for each website or application that you use. If the password is found in the dark web, you can quickly identify which site it came from and change it. Next, never send compromising images of yourself to anyone, no matter who they say they are. It is very easy to impersonate someone online, so you can never be 100% sure of who the recipient is. Lastly, cover your webcams when you're not using them. Do this for your laptops, smartphones, and tablets. Webcam covers are a foolproof method of ensuring that no one can spy on you by hacking your camera and can be purchased online for very cheap. You can also leave me a comment on this video and I would be happy to send one to you. Remember, if you receive a threatening email that contains an old password, partial phone number, a sense of urgency, or poor spelling, just report it to your IT department so they can block it. Chances are good that the threat is fabricated and you don't have anything to worry about. Thank you.